America's skin here. It's time for another edition of Skin Flicks, courtesy of the good people over at Quick. I woke up this morning and I realized the only thing I know about the Irish is Lucky Charms and the 86 Celtics. That is not nearly enough. So we came to the North Texas Irish Festival. As you can see it going on behind me, these men uh, preparing to be very Irish. We decided to learn more and bring it to you on this edition of Skin Flicks. Are you enjoying the Irish Festival so far? So far we have, yes. What have you guys been doing? Uh, walking, eating. Walking and eating are two very traditional Irish things, so I think you guys are covering the whole spectrum. All right, I think one of the cheap stereotypes about the Irish is they like to drink a lot of beer. and yeah! I think by judging from that guy, you can see it's clearly not true. Okay, I'm here with two lovely Irish ladies, Mary Ellen and Rita. Now, I'm working on my Irish accent, so I thought I would try it out on you guys, and you could let me know how authentic it is. Okay, Skip, go ahead. Okay. Arr, mighty. Look at how Irish I am. Arr. Keep trying. Sound like, sound like a pirate to me. Uh, keep trying. Okay, now. Irish. Good try. Do I have this right, that you married someone who was not Irish? Yeah, but we're getting a divorce. Oh, wow, so that's good news, right? You know, let's get rid of anyone who's not Irish. Yeah. Arr, mighty. Arr, where's me booty, arr? No, that's a pirate with scurvy. No. Okay. Uh, what is this that you're drinking? Actually, it's a blue moon. I wanted a Killian's, but my stepdad got me the wrong beer. Okay, well, you can, can never trust a stepdad. Arr, mighty, I'm Irish, arr. Sounds more pirate to me. Okay. Well, what's the difference? I don't know. Yeah, I don't either. <laughs> I'm very, very curious about the bagpipe. Uh, are you a fan of the bagpipe? You know, it's kind of a weird contradiction about it. It's usually, like, when I get a bag and a pipe together, that's, like, the last sound I want to hear. You know, I like, want to go over some Pink Floyd or, I don't know, Massive Attack or Dub Reggae or something. Arr, mighty, where's the booty, Arr? Irish. Irish. What would you recommend I eat while I'm here? Irish food, um, well, you know, of course you got the potato, which is not actually native to Ireland. Uh, it just caused a big famine, yeah. right? Yeah, because it wasn't. Potatoes, you know, they're not supposed to be grown in Ireland. But we should have disdain for the potato. That's right, we should. We should Urgh, I hate the potato. Have you ever had to kill an animal with your bare hands? Um, you know, I, I hate to say this, but one of my sons and I did slaughter a lamb once to butcher it. So Yeah, we did that once. It was like more of a satanic ritual thing. Well, than... It was close, but you know. Okay, so then do you have beef with some of the Irish people here since you're a Scot? Not really. What about the British? No. What about the Welsh? A little bit. Okay, okay, so we've pinpointed them. <laughs> what, uh, you want to send a threatening message to the Welsh right now? No, that's okay. Okay, well, I like your style. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so then there's anybody here that you have beef with that you need a score to settle or anything like that? No, I'm good. All right, you want to start some? <laughs> okay. Go kick that guy's ass right over there. I think you can take him. <laughs> oh, sure. All right, do you have a threatening message you want to deliver to the British? Oh, I'm, I have no problem with the British. <laughs> okay. Well, I think that things are going to work out well for you and the British. Okay. See? I lingered in a should I pick a fight with a Scot or anything like that? Um, you could, but I don't recommend it. Are they tough? They're pretty tough. I couldn't really hurt anybody, so I think picking a fight with anybody would be a, a problem for me. All right, that's going to do it from here at the North Texas Irish Festival. I'd like to thank all the good Irish who helped us out and gave us their time. But most of all, I'd like to thank Emma. Emma, give me a hug. Oh, so Irish. All right, until next time, we'll see you next time. Stay Irish. Hey. Adios. Hey. Thank you, ladies. Keep it Irish. Uh, keep it Irish. Slant up. Word. All right, well, uh, keep it Irish. Thank you. It's working. Sound man. Adjust my levels, man. My mic's straight, I got future fans and they shouldn't have to wait DJs I never met spin a set, I'm in the crate As long as said, select and put the needle to the plate And give me a little play, we ain't need to know the bed The people can relate, and I've gotta find a way to put a little food up in my face Cause the record